Yo, what's going on? Sexy Sam Landis Squad today. We're here doing a ranked 1v1 as always. Nothing new here. And we're gonna be locking in. What god, 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 what god. Um uh, let's do ROM. Let's do a ROM game. I haven't played ROM in a while. He banned some weirdo bands, Gilgamesh, Bologna, Osiris. So he definitely doesn't want to fight any warriors. Good thing I'm not a warrior. Big man in charge is his name. Okay. <sighs> Sorry, I'm a yawning. I'm a, I'm a yawner boy. Grab my generic start and you can see the MMRs right there. Uh, he has 2660. It's in GM, obviously. I have 2608. I am in GM, obviously. And uh, that's a little breakdown for you guys. I know you guys really enjoyed it the last time I, I put that in. So I figured why not keep it up? Forgot to buy a relic. Kind of awkward. <clears throat> All right, that's all right. Duel is a small map. We can still get to red in time. He will have posi positioning over us, but it's fine. Minions have spawned. All right. He used his two, so I just rolled away. No point. There's honestly no point in me fighting him if he uses his two. There's literally no point in me fighting if he ever uses this too. But that being said, we are out clearing pretty significantly. I have mannequins, so this buff should fall down to me pretty quick. He also has mannequins, but little fact for you, a little factoid. Oh, hello. You can't have two mannequin buffs on the same... Uh, two mannequin debuffs, I should say, on the same unit in the game. Whether that be a god or, you know, a buff. So if one person has mannequins and another person hits it, that other person is literally just stacking the first person's mannequin for them. So you don't actually need to worry about their mannequins getting hit. Uh, you are dead here. Nice. I had to take my time and make sure that I didn't miss, but we did end up getting the kill. Huge, 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 huge. And also, what's kind of big is the fact that I can still clear a wave. And now I'm going to go do my, uh, do my blue buff. I don't know if leveling the one is even worth it, by the way. I honestly don't know. But I'm told, and I know I listen to what people tell me a lot in terms of like how to level gods, even though they're probably like in silver. But um, I'm told that leveling the two is better. So that's what I'm doing. If it's wrong, blame the comment section, not me. <laughs> but also you can blame me because I listen to the comment section. <laughs> Let's see. We're almost level 7. You will hit level 6 off this wave. He did hit level 6 off the wave. Um, I'm really surprised he doesn't want to fight more. I would feel like... As Freya... Before I get my Ichival, like, you'd be down to just slam. Now that I have my Ichival... You definitely don't want to fight until you have either an advantageous fight where I'm, like, half HP at the start of it. Or... Um... You get that Hecate online, and for some reason, it's doing all sorts of wonders for you. More than an Ichival is. I doubt it would do more than an Ichival, but maybe. Maybe, maybe. Okay. I mean, I'm, I'm down to clown, dude. I'm down to clown. I will sit here and ruin your back. For as long as possible. I literally don't care. Uh, 
Let's see. I hit all my snipes, but it didn't kill. Which is kind of unfortunate, but also kind of expected. And it's not that big of a deal because red buff spawned anyways, so it's not like we're gonna be losing a whole bunch of stuff for it. Well, more than likely, the only thing we're gonna lose of not getting the kill there is his blue buff. I would assume that I cannot get his blue buff right now. Might be a, my, a wrong assumption, but we'll see. I am going um, Pestilence. Oh, I should go Shoguns. No, because I don't need that much attack speed, right? I don't need to go Shoguns. The anti-heal is probably more worth it against Afreya, to be honest. Probably more worth it. I'm going to ward right here because he might be cornering. He is not cornering. He went over there. That's a big misplay, dude. That is a big misplay. You all... You all here? Damn, dude, that life steal carried. It carried. <clears throat> I also missed, uh, I made him miss two ticks of his ult, but I also missed a couple of auto attacks while I was fighting, which really, I mean, that just obviously is the reason I lost the fight. Nothing else would be the reason I lost the fight. Because <clears throat> I should have won. I should have won that fight. Straight up. No ifs, ands, or buts. That was my fight to lose, and I lost it, so. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Just tier through breastplate. We are on an even playing field again. Because his items are cheaper than mine. Um... Annoying. Damn, when he uses his one, he chunks so hard, and I do almost no damage, I feel like. I don't really have a lot of damage built, to be fair, but... I don't know, I feel like I should be doing more than that. I feel like I should be pumping out higher numbies right now. But maybe it just seems like I'm not because when he hits me, he has lifesteal. And when I hit him, I don't have lifesteal. So maybe it feels like it's worse than it actually is. I don't know. Maybe I should just go Aussie. Fix the problem entirely. You gonna banish me? Like, that was good damage, but it, he's just going to heal it up in, like, two auto attacks. You know what I mean? That's the issue. Wait, are you giving me this? Okay, that was a misplay. He definitely has what he needs in order to stop me from farming, but he's not doing it. <clears throat> Which I guess I'm lucky for. You know, I should be happy about that, but I feel like... I'm also not that happy about it because the later this game gets, the more I'm kind of frickled. You know what I mean? Ow. Right, he's got no cooldowns up. Okay, <clears throat> so that's, I guess that's one of the good things I can do, is I can abuse the fact that he has to use cooldowns in order to auto attack, and I don't. So I can just kind of abuse that range advantage I have over him on most of the time. But it is still scary. Like, even with a quote-unquote range advantage I sometimes have, it is still scary. Why do you go anti-heal? I'm not healing at all yet. I don't even have my Aussie yet. What if I just don't go Aussie? 
probably still worth it for me to go Aussie because he's only has 25% anti-heal. But what if I just didn't get it because he got Contagion? Like, what if I just went Xy or something right now? What's stopping me from doing that? Nothing. I'm actually just going to do this. I was trolling when I originally pulled it. Then I saw how much damage I really do. And I was like, you know what, dude? Why not? He should die here, I think. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay. I had to be silent there for a second. I'm I apologize because it took all my brain power to understand what I had to do in order to win that fight. Not because it was a hard fight to win, but because I didn't want to miss. Because if you okay. <laughs> Let me explain. If you alt as Rom and they have one HP and then you don't kill them, not only are you a menace to society as a whole, but you're also an idiot. So <laughs> I and I didn't want to publicly like I didn't want to publicly put out the fact that I'm an idiot because I missed all my ROM shots So instead what did I do I just you know I shut the heck up and I focused And we take those You're not getting my tower get away from me, please Um, yeah, I actually don't win these fights. We'll be back here. We're definitely back here. I'm actually not going to go. Uh, oh, actually, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going to do this because he's going more lifesteal right now. <clears throat> I, I think I want to go XC and I just am going to skip out on the uh, the Aussie because he already built a little bit anti heal, so I just don't care about. The healing at this point. I'd rather have the damage. And I'm okay with that. I really am. He got his blue, I would assume. Yes, he did. Um, All right, we're just farming. We're farming right now. But don't farm too much because, you know, if you let her get, like, another item online, you will lose the game by default. So farm while you can. Don't overdo it. Because that's how you lose games against Freya. All right, now we'll pressure. Pressure, we're pressure. Oh God. All right, a lot of her cooldown is gone now. Okay, I missed all my auto attacks, so we actually lose this fight really bad. Um. Oh, nice shell. Nice shell. But I will get Phoenix. But it was still a good shell. Oh, I will not get Phoenix. My damage is horrible. What did I think would happen? Um... Cannot end. He has Bancrofts too, you know, like he's healing so much. <laughs> healing so much. He's gonna back. No, thank you. And I lied. I am gonna go Aussie. I, I wasn't gonna. I wasn't gonna, but I feel like because of how long that fight was and the fact that we're kind of like almost tickling each other in terms of damage, I knew that was gonna happen. I didn't care. And then the fact that we're like tickling each other in terms of damage, we're not like bursting each other down really fast. I feel like the Aussie is going to be really good for me to disengage 
and come back with a bunch of damage. Not necessarily damage, I suppose, but like I can do more damage because I have more HP type deal. <clears throat> um, probably has this two up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead, clear my wave. No, thank you. That's fine. I am not scared. Okay, she ulted. She ulted to not die to my ult, but that does give us Phoenix and the tower. And maybe the fight? No, not the fight. Not the fight. We just run. We run. Don't get crazy with the fight. No reason to get crazy with the fight. Get the wave. I don't care. Get my tower if you can. I'm, I'm sure Bull Demon's almost over. Okay, my whole computer just froze. Ah! We are in vibe territory, boys. Vibe territory. Um, I actually will go oboe just because I want to. I want to focus hitting the Titan now, um, rather than hitting him. And if I am hitting him, I still want to be doing damage to Titan and vice versa. You know, if I'm hitting the Titan, I want to be doing some damage to him. So oboe is gonna help me do a little bit of like best of both world, Miley Cyrus type shit, and a Montana technically, I guess. Ah, if he missed that, I won the game. Because he cannot fight me. With his cooldown like that, he can't fight me at all. Um. Alright, we'll grab these and then I'll go finish my oboe. And I'm hoping that I can win. I mean, the Toxic Blade did get online, so his attack speed is going to be really fast. Again, like I said before, I think four items is the point where... Freya starts hitting really hard like that's if Freya gets to four items you pretty much have lost the game unless you you outplay it in a pretty significant manner so that's what I'm gonna have to do here I guess I'll do some Titan damage here. Oh no, I'm dead. Ah, uh, shit. Um, yeah, I'm dead as fuck. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He cut, dude. He he whooped my dash, and I died because of it. And I don't know what to think, dude. I'm kind of scared because I don't think that I win this game anymore. <laughs> I really don't. I did focus on clearing the wave before I died, which is huge, by the way. Like, if I didn't do that, we probably would have lost the game, actually. But um, he does have red buff and his and his. This Phoenix is back up, so looking pretty terrifying for me. Okay, he didn't get red buff, actually. Because he went for Bull Demon. So I'm gonna go for red buff. Which should give me some sort of advantage. My by the way, keep in mind, my build only has 60 power. Literally 60. So most of my damage. Actually, like literally 70 out of my entire build is from Age of All, so. Um. All right. Okay. 
I'm I'm okay with that for one reason. He was focusing the minions, but he still let them get inside the Phoenix. So I was able to get the Phoenix, and I was also able to clear the wave, which is the only reason I'm okay with that trade. If I wasn't able to clear the wave, that trade would have been horrible for me. But because I got it, I think we're in the clear. We're, we're okay for now. Um, he probably will be able to get my Titan. Well, not my Titan. I, think, I, I really hope he can't get my Titan, but he'll probably be able to get my tower. Um, but he won't be able to get my Phoenix, which is the important part of everything. Okay. This is going to be a really, really tough game, dude. A really really tough game My God, he actually out damaged me there. No way. How did he out damage me there? I had upgraded shell on, which means his, by the way, upgraded shell means he does 50% less damage with autos. Oh no, they reduced it down to only 20%. Well, that's fucking awful. It was 50% before and they lowered it down to 20? That's a bunch of bullshit. Alright, buying this item literally doubles my power, by the way. I'm gonna do that. Oh shit. I might have waited too long, man. I might have not pressured enough. Now I can't win the game because it's a late game Freya. Oh god. I might have made a mistake, boys. Might be the end of me. Ow. The divines have blessed me with this drink. But I do have almost 200 power right now, which is really nice, but I have no relics up. He doesn't have relics up either, but he doesn't need them. I actually need mine. Okay, this is going to give me the Phoenix back. Um. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Oh my god. What an insane last fight. Holy shit. That was so close, man. That was so close. Getting that that uh, extra two or getting the extra 60 power. But I basically shot my power from 70. Or it was 60, right? I had 60 power. Basically shot my power from uh from 60 to about 198 or like 200 or something like that. I forget what what I had exactly. But with the red buff, getting the mannequins for the 60 power and um and what was the the last thing? And the 500 pot with all that stuff combined, shooting up to 200 power made my autos hit like an extra 50 or 60 higher. Oh, that mattered so much, dude. That mattered so much. Let's go. Oh, I guess I'm in masters now. Shouldn't be surprising because my MMR is really bad for GM, but let's go, dude. I'm hyped. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys.
Peace.